Hey everyone, here's a question on number line. The question is represent 2 by 7, 5 by 7 and 6 by 7 on number line. So to do this, we're going to draw a number line first. And this is a 0. The first number is 0 because we don't have a negative fractions here. We have only positive. So we're going to start with 0 here. And here we have a 1. Now, so let me just mark it once again. So this will be a 1. Okay, so what to do is look for the denominator. You have a 7, right? For each fraction, you have a denominator 7. So you make a 7 equal parts. So this will be a first equal part 1, then 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. So let me just count the spaces here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So you have a 7 equal parts. Don't count this lines, just count the space here equal parts. So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Now, once we have done this, you have to start marking it. So this will be the first one will be 1 by 7 because out of 7, this is the first part, right? So this is a 1 by 7. This is 2 by 7. This will be 3 by 7, 4 by 7, 5 by 7. This is 6 by 7. And the last one will be 7 by 7. But we know that 7 by 7 is nothing but 1. It's equal to 1, right? And here 0, you can write it as 0 by 7, anything. If you want, you can write down 0 as 0 by 7, if you want it. Okay, now you want to start marking it. So first one is 2 by 7. So 2 by 7 is located here. This is 2 by 7. Let me take it as A. The next we have 5 by 7, which is here, which I'm going to take it as B. And the next one is 6 by 7, which is located here. I'm going to mark it as C. That's it. So in case you have more numbers like a 9 by 7 like that, you're going to have that number between 1 and 2 because we have up to 6 by 7. So I have stopped here. The next number will be after 7 by 7. The next part will be 8 by 7. In case we have a numbers like that, like a 9 by 7 or 10 by 7. So you have to keep on making a 7 equal parts between 1 and 2 now because I have stopped between 0 and 1 because I know that all this number will going to come between 0 and 1. If you have a numbers which will go like after 1, then you make again 7 equal parts and mark, you can just continue the marking. So this is 7 by 7, so next will be 8 by 7, the next will be 9 by 7. So continue like that. So I hope this question is clear. In case you have another question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.